Hello everyone and welcome back for another one of Xander's One Shots. Today we're going to be trying out Ballistic Mini Golf. I am a fan of mini golf as a whole and I'm a fan of mini golf games. I do think that they're very relaxing, very cool fun and also they can be quite challenging. And there's been a few that have come out over the last couple of, uh, well... I suppose the last couple of years really to think about it and some of them involve gravity around planets some of them involve um you know varied mechanics with the balls itself ballistic mini golf let's jump in and we'll show what this game has to offer uh so i think we're just going to do in fact can we just jump straight in right at the start yeah and we can spin around we can aim up and down and it's click and hold to actually get the... Ah, uh, it was way too hard. To get the ball going. Tiny tap. And, yeah. Okay, so we're, we're on par. We could probably do better. Heading over there. Let's see what we could do as far as power goes. Oh, it goes... Oh, it goes up and down. Okay. Almost spot on the middle, bit too far. You do kind of wonder who builds these uh, mini golf things in space. Oh God, uh, yeah, we definitely don't want to skip out of this. Now it's part two, so we've already gone over. But a bogey's not too bad. Certainly when we're getting used to the game as a whole. We've got a little bit of a, a hop up. So let's give this some welly. And that gets us back on par. Not bad at all. And they've got a good fast turnaround. I'm happy about that. Let's uh, let's try something a bit bouncy. Let's put us in a good position for the next shot. We can uh, we can totally manage this. And too much, too much. Ooh, didn't go over though. I have to say I do like the uh, the level of. Detail. Ah, oh, that was so close. Um, between the, the textures of the ball, the textures of the course itself, and just the uh, the layout and uh, and feel of the graphics. A lot of um, games I see, they go very, very cartoony. And while that can be cool for the aesthetic, it's not always what you want to see. Uh, let's go huge on the bounce. We're not going to get a hole in one, but we're going to get damn close. Look at that. All right, little tap. Too much, too much. Overzealous. It's still a birdie, but uh, all that does is put us back on par. Ooh, yeah. Could we could bounce it, or we can try and jump it. Let's let's try and jump it. <laughs> that was the that was the wrong move. And that also did exactly the same. All right, we'll try and bounce it. Curses. I get the feeling this one is going to uh, to take longer. Oh, so close. If I'd just gone a bit slower at the start, it would all be fine. There we go. Well, it looks like it is possible to get a hole in one if you're better. The past four. A little bit further. Ah, oh, just a tiny bit further. That time I didn't have enough legs on it. Wow. Par four, we got 12. Not so cool. Not so cool. All right. Can we skim down that tiny bit there? Need to zoom in, really. Oh! Oh, that was that was damn close. Fair. All right. Well, we got that one in on par. Two more holes to go. Ooh, and we're starting to get chomp chompers. All right. I think we'll want to go around like that. Par four, we should be able to make it in in three. Just 
once again, a bit too much power. About the same should get it. Ah, oh, and it just just skipped over. It is uh it is tricky. It is tricky. That puts us on plus nine, an abysmal score so far. And this one, I think we're going up and over. Maybe, maybe off to that side. Let's have a look this way. Hey, what a guess. What a guess. All right. Not too powerful. That brings it back to plus seven. I don't think that's too bad. All right. So now we're on to the back nine, I assume. Uh, let's try and curve round a bit. And if we're lucky, we'll be in a position to be able to curve round this next time. That's not too bad. I'll take it. I'll take it. Oh, so close. <laughs> And yeah, a reasonable par. Okay. What has it got next? Uh, probably just enough over the top. I can't actually see over there. Can we, we can't move around. Oh, I see. It's part way up and part way up. Right. So we're off to a, a cracking start. Let's uh, try that again. Don't don't roll all the way back. This is gonna be this is gonna be painful. Stop 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 stop. <laughs> okay. Fair. I'll take it. I'll take it. That could have gone a lot worse. All right, straight up the middle again. 30. Hey, a hole in one. That was a lucky skip. Oh god. Um, well, it should carry us through. Oh no, no! Curse my sudden yet inevitable demise. Now that was a- that's- that's sneaky. I could not see them at all. All right, that's uh. If we hadn't been for that penalty, that would have been okay. And this looks like it's a, a skip and a skip, so let's hit it reasonably hard and hop, hop. Oh, this is going to be a little tricky, but uh... yeah, that'll work. That'll work. We're bringing our score back. Huh. Up and over, eh? Up and back down. Look at that. Look at... No, no, don't don't get stuck there. Don't get stuck there. Don't... That's fine. I can make this work. Uh, now, the trick I used to do when playing pool was... Work out the distance from there to the actual edge. And then the same again, and then try and bounce off that. And if oh physics works, then you end up roughly on target. It's a lot easier to eyeball with a uh, pool cue than uh, than with a golf ball, but it's still pretty damn good. And that's a that's a big jump all the way over. No guts, no glory. <laughs> that was. That was not enough. Let's go big. Too much. Okay, we'll we'll try one more. Okay, we might have to go round. Oh, okay, tiny bit more will do it. No, that was the same. Oh, and it. The physics collision on that ramp was a little bit off. Um, we're going to have to go round now. 
which is okay. I mean, we could have done it right from the start, but you gotta try. You gotta try the challenges. Yeah, if you don't push yourself, you'll you'll never pull off those amazing hole-in-one moves. And don't you dare go off the edgy damn wall. And there we go. <laughs> it's only plus seven, uh, and it's it's certainly not the the worst that we've ever done, but it's uh, it's not brilliant. Okay. Oh yeah, that's certainly tricky. Let's go big. And over the edge. Okay, we can do that better. No, it bounced back. Bounced back the wrong way. So the wrong way. Okay. Uh... Wow. I think that actually bounced back in a way that physics would complain about. Still, one of the things I love about um, games like this is working out the the oddities and intricacies of the game itself. We may actually be in a position to be able to get over this now. Let's uh, let's try doing it a little more carefully. And up and down. Don't 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 don't. We can totally do this. A gentle hop over. Oh. Well, I mean, it was a it was a par six. We got it in in twelve. I'm happy enough with that. Oh God, is that an accelerator and a sandbar? All right. Off to a cracking start. Should have run in a lot faster on that. Oh, that's not what I intended at all. I pushed the button a bit too early. Now, is it going to push us? Yes, it is. Well, that would have been a lot easier for us to just go and do right from the start. So close. So close. You can almost feel it on your whiskers. <laughs> Triple bogey. Well, 45 is, is not brilliant, but it could be a lot worse. And this, we've got to do some kind of jump thing, so... More jump, more jumpy than that. That's not bad. Let's try and slide in on this. There we go. Uh, four out of three. That's going to push us round. Yeah, let's just hammer on in. Zoom. Notice the extra go faster glow that we have. And is that too much? Just a little too much. Still don't have my uh, eye in for the acceleration and deceleration yet. But uh, overall, the, uh, the game itself is performing pretty damn well. There's a couple of um, ricochet things which I've not entirely been convinced with, but you can't get everything the way you want it to be. Hey, and a hole in one again. It's actually brought us down to par. Which is where we wanted to be. Oh god. Uh Let's go up. And bounce and bounce and on the flat and stop though. No, not quite on the flat. No, stop, 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 stop. All right, here we go. Just a little, no, stop. Damn it, it's gonna go right back where it was. <sighs> what a pain. What a pain. Ah! The, the frustration I am feeling with myself right now. There we go. Fair. 
Now it does give you an indicator to show how much you uh, you did on the last time uh, down here with the uh, the stroke power, but that requires you actually paying attention to it. Let's go this way, and we'll just catch this. And I thought maybe it would be enough to push us around. Not quite, but we can get ourselves lined up here and in the area. And we're going to get par unless I screw this up, which is an entire possibility. There we go. So we're still doing okay. We're still on par. Now this is course 3 of 17. Um, so there is a hell of a lot to... Is that a bounce pad? Uh, for us to see throughout this. It is. And that is obviously not the way to do it, but... That was closer. A little bit more. And it's up, and... In the right place, at least. So we're going to be over par. Double mode. But we did make it over the jump, which makes me happy. I think we skipped that entire thing. Oh, that didn't that didn't bounce us the way I thought it would. No, it's it's not as powerful. All right. What an evil, evil game. Oh, come on. <laughs> that was just cruel. You know what? I'll take it. I'll take it because that's an improvement. And that's at least in a place where we can try and get over this. Oh, we've got to get up and down. This may take some careful positioning. And may take more than one attempt. Oh, no. Just ricocheted back. We'll try again. There we go. <laughs> Plus six. It's it's normally about this point that we start really failing. Yeah, I think that's a mistake. That's a nice enough place for us to be, but I'm not convinced that the angle is going to be great for getting us over here. Oh, that. That works. I'll take it. I will take that every day. Albatross. And he didn't screw it up. Albatross. We're still plus four. Unlikely we'll get it back on this last hole, but we'll uh, we'll give it a go. Ooh, hello. Oh, that's that's going to be so tricky. Okay, let's move a bit closer. Too close, too close, too close. Damn it. Good start. Brilliant start there. Let's try that again. Oh, no. No, that totally skipped out. Okay. Okay. Gently does it, although we've put ourselves in a terrible position for actually moving forwards. Yes! I can't believe that worked. We're, we're actually going to do this in power, I reckon. Fair. Yeah. 
I will, I will totally take that. So that is a couple of the uh, uh, the courses for this. Let's uh, let's go back to the main menu. Uh, and while we're here, let's have a look and see if there's any controls that I'm missing. I don't think there is. Nope, that's it. It is as fun as that. Uh, there is the potential for multiplayer in this, uh, so you can play against your friends. You can play with the controller as well, um, but it is quite fun. And the level design seem, uh, seems certainly interesting. The game is uh, responsive and it's pretty. I really like how pretty it is. There's a lot of detail that's been put into making it look nice and smooth and uh, the game mechanics for the levels, they're interesting and challenging. Uh, so this is Ballistic Mini Golf. If you're interested in picking it up yourself, there will be a link in the description below. Uh, if you are enjoying these videos, then be sure to give me a thumbs up. Otherwise, I'll see you next time for something completely different. I'll see you soon.